the U.S. Agency for International Development, USAID, the Youth Resilience, Inclusion and Empowerment, WIRI program, in collaboration with the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, has launched the Community Reentry Program, CIRIP, to address the critical gap in cross-agency support for the rehabilitation and reintegration of adult offenders into the St. Lucian society while recognizing the essential role of community involvement for its success. Launched on June 21, 2024, via the St. Lucia Social Development Fund, SSDF, a satellite agency of the Ministry of Equity, the program will engage government officials, community leaders and stakeholders to support a pivotal turning point in promoting second chances. At the heart of CIREP is a commitment to ensuring that St. Lucian communities are safe, healthy and whole, stated Phelps Feely, Chief of Party USAID, Wiry Project. At the heart of CIREP is a dedication to ensuring St. Lucian communities are safe, healthy and whole. The CIREP partners, all of us, share an understanding of the value and importance of second chances that a person's worth and future should not be wholly determined by a singular action. We also share an appreciation of the incredible challenges of reentry when there is a lack of community support and a breakdown of trust. For 18 months, CIREP will offer tailored case management, life skills, vocational and remedial education training, entrepreneurial support, career counseling, community engagement, psychosocial support, and basic needs assistance. Minister for Home Affairs, Crime Prevention and Persons with Disabilities, Honorable Jeremiah Norbert, emphasized the importance of psychosocial support in the reintegration process. I'm happy that I, the first component of the CIRA program is where they provide the psychosocial support to the individuals. This is a very essential part of reintegrating individuals into society, preparing them for what to expect. Here's what you're not, don't think that you're just going there and it's going to be a bed of roses and we cannot, and we have to be honest with individuals as to what they should expect. The services are designed to provide participants with the resources necessary to re-enter their community successfully and reduce the likelihood of re-offending. Partners include the Borderly Correctional Facility, Probation and Parole Services in the Ministry of Home Affairs, Justice and National Security, the Boys Training Center, BTC, the James Belgrave Microenterprise Development Fund, Bell Fund, the Center for Adolescence Renewal and Education, and the National Skills Development Center of the Ministry of Education. Further underscoring the societal mindset changes needed for successful reintegration as the Minister for Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, the Honorable Joachim Henry. We were socialized not to welcome back into our society inmates. The intervention will not be successful based on how well the programs are designed. It is when the surgical intervention in the minds of all of us that would allow us to view St. Lucians, our people, inmates coming out of prison differently. And when we can be less judgmental about our people and view them differently, then we are on the road to achieve great success. The USAID WIRI program, launched in St. Lucia on February 2023, continues to work with government and non-government partners to strengthen social services, improve learning outcomes, prepare youth for the workforce, and build resilient families and communities. From the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, Chevrolet Marius.